Hello, it's Webster and Erin here from TFM's Wake Up With Webster. And guess what we're doing today? We're master bakers. And we are at the ideal place to learn all about baking, especially when it comes to pies. So please welcome, from Money's Bakers, the legendary Linda. <laughs> <laughs> we're here because uh, this Saturday it is the birthday of Money's. 115 years young. That's a lot of pies. That's a lot of pies, especially out of here. They <laughs> sell a lot in a week, never mind 115 years. Now, Linda, Muddies are famed for your pies. You've been world champions before, so what makes your pies special? I think the fact that we make everything on site in our bakery here. Uh, we make our own pie shells, we use the best of mints, we season them, we have our wee secret ingredient, and we sell them straight from the bakery in the shop. Well, you've heard us talking about the breakfast pie on Wake Up With Webster. Erin and I both got different ideas. You've heard some of the ideas we've uh -huh. got from listeners as well. What do you think from your point of view, your opinion? What's the I best pie? I think definitely you have to have your sausage and bacon in a breakfast pie. And, well, the fruit pudding, I say, that could be quite nice. I'll, I'll wait till I try that. Oh, that could hash brown, yeah, definitely. definitely. We're just looking for different yeah. things because exactly. it's quite easy to go down the bacon, egg and sausage route. Yeah. But let's make it sure it's a Western egg and special. Different and then, then let's, let's sample them. That's the best way to find out. That sounds good to me. Okay, let's get cooking. We're going to get the pies organised and uh, you'll see us go really fast like this. Because <laughs> uh, we're master bakers. <laughs> And then we'll have the final breakfast pie ready um, for, for eating and tasting at the yes. end and we'll get your opinion, Linda. Perfect. Right, let's, let's do this. Let's right go. Here. So there we go, we've done our pies. Six over here with a hash brown lid with sausage, bacon, haggis, and brown sauce inside. Can't it's, wait to taste it. This Sunday was a sausage uh, muncher and took all my sausage, so I've only been able to make four. Sausage knicker. Knicker, that's what I meant to say. Not much. Sounds right, does it? Uh, sausage knicker, steal my sausages, so I've only got four. So the pies are done, Erin, explain what's in your one. I have gone for a fruit dumpling at the bottom, just to give it that wee sweet taste, a wee bit extra, with some cut up sausage round there, some bacon, some black pudding, some beans, and a potato scone lid. And it's the very, food works. Very filling. Very filling. We'll right. fire them in the oven. Let's get them in the oven. And then we'll have a wee sampling session. Let's go. Perfect. Right, it's now time for the moment of truth. They've been cooked, they've been baked, they're here, they've been cut. So I'm we, nervous. We need the expert judges <laughs> to taste them here at Money's Ooh, and Baker's in, on. in South Street. <laughs> so Linda, the boss, and Colin, the master baker, please take a bite. Oh. <laughs> Did you know what we eh? Yeah. Biased. Well, we can hear the crunch of the hash brown lid, mm -hmm. the sausage, I did cut it up quite finely. There was a lot in it. Really nice. Mm -hmm. And the brown sauce? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can you, can you taste the brown sauce? Because there's only a little dribble. Really? I actually think it's just as well you put the brown sauce in it, just to moisten it a wee bit. Yeah. And the haggis, is it overpowering? No, just fine. Perfect. Okay, no need to taste mm -hmm. the other one. We've got a winner. Let's go. See ya. <laughs> right, here we go, Erin. <laughs> Mm. And this is the all day pie, so it's quite right. filling. Oh, they've been to mm. <laughs> That goes well, actually, it does. Yes! I didn't that is very well. like David <laughs> Thomas's. He didn't say it was good, this goes it's well. It goes well, it does. Never doubt a Linton in a kitchen. <laughs> My dad raised me. So. I'm sorry, I'm going for the Webster pie. What about you, Colin? You going for Erin's pie? He's still eating it. <laughs> <laughs> I, no, I, I, I just want to win fairly. 
anyway, so uh, I just tried to make it a bit different. Sorry, Erin. I thought yours was a bit boring. I thought mine was a bit more interesting. Colin will probably give you a vote because he... Yeah, yeah I think so. Make it impartial. Are you being genuine yeah. or are you just trying to not make me cry? Because I don't cry. Oh, it's even Stevenson, I'll take that. Okay, your next mission then, if you want to taste our pies, and of course you do, why wouldn't you? Look how delicious they are. Uh, our judges agree. Come on down to Murray's Bakers this Saturday for their 115th birthday party. We're going to have a pie eating competition, there'll be loads of prizes to give away, there'll be celebrity appearances and guests and live music. And we'll be there. And us. Mm. And our pies. Hey. And we're going to raise money for cash for kids. So thank you to Colin and Linda from Murray's the Bakers. You're welcome. Look forward to it. See you on Saturday. See you Saturday! Yeah.